Whoa! <laughs> What's up, internet friends? Uh, welcome to Future Proof Homes, where we build private, AI-powered voice assistants for the smart home. My name is Brad Davis, and today's video is kind of a big deal. Kind of a big deal. Really? Because it's time to share a sneak peek of our upcoming local AI base station that we call Nexus. So if you think big tech's cloud-based AI voice assistants are creepy, then Nexus will blow your mind. <gasps> Great, Odin's Raven! But first, I've got to share some quick news about our global store expansion and the new upcoming Satellite One enclosures. Okay, so the futureproofhomes.net store is officially live in the US, EU, and the UK. Shipping is totally free, taxes are included in the price, and we're including a USB-C cable and power adapter in every box. So head on over to the store now to pre-order the Satellite One dev kit for our upcoming batch three that is shipping out later this month. Next up, let's talk about our new Squarical enclosure family. We're launching three new enclosures for the Satellite One dev kit. The large enclosure design, which supports a three inch speaker, and it actually supports six different three inch speakers that you can choose from. The medium Squarical design, which supports a handful of two inch speakers you can choose from and the small squarical design that supports a couple different one inch enclosed mini speakers. All three of these enclosures use the exact same top piece and the same Satellite One dev kit board, which means you can easily upgrade the speaker over time. Head over to docs.futureproofhomes.net to download the 3D printer files and follow the assembly instructions. If you don't have a 3D printer, then join our Discord, link in the description, and perhaps a kind soul there will print and ship you an enclosure. Alternatively, you can always use online 3D printing services like craftcloud3d.com to print your enclosure and they'll send it back to you. Lastly, for those of you that want a pre-built speaker, we are working on it. Give us a little bit more time and I'll share details soon. All I can say now is that plastic injection molding is really expensive and time consuming, especially for smart speakers that have strict requirements around microphones. Okay, so now let's discuss Nexus. To start with, what is it? Well, Nexus is a tiny AI computer that runs our custom LLM voice agent. It acts like the central brain of all the Satellite One speakers that might be scattered around your home. And when you ask the Satellite One for the weather or to turn on the light or to lock a door, the Nexus AI base station processes that voice request and instructs your smart home hub what to do. And then it sends a response back to the Satellite One speaker. No cloud necessary, no internet connection required. And well, it's probably just better to watch the live demo. I promise none of this video is doctored in any way, and it is all in real time running our actual code and our actual hardware. Check it out. All right, so here's my large speaker over here. Hey, Nexus. What time is it and what is today's date? The current time is 2.49 p.m. and today's date is June 17th, 2025. Hey Nexus, can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Maybe ask me who I am so that we can meet. I'm Nexus, your smart home assistant. I'm here to help you with any questions or tasks you may have. I don't have a personal identity, but I'm always happy to chat with you and learn more about your preferences and habits. As for who you are, I don't have any information about your identity. Would you like to share a bit about yourself? What's your name and what brings you here today? My name is Brad Davis. I am your creator and it's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Brad. I'm glad to be of service to you. As my creator, you've likely given me a lot of thought and care. I'm here to help make your life easier and more enjoyable, whether that's through controlling your smart home devices, answering questions, hey, Nexus. or just providing a friend. Can you turn on the media room ceiling fans and set the media room mood lighting to the color purple at 100% brightness? The media room ceiling fans are now on, 
and the mood lighting in the media room is set to the color purple at 100% brightness. Hey Nexus, can you remind me to get some sleep tomorrow? You have a reminder to get some sleep tomorrow. Hey Nexus, can you search for the song Bohemian Rhapsody by Queen and play it in the loft? The song Bohemian Rhapsody by Queen is now just There it is, it's playing. Hey Nexus, can you turn on the Better Together LEDs? Are now on. So you can see our small enclosures over here. Um, we also have voice assistants in our ceiling, and I call all these uh, Jarvis, so we can talk to that one too. Um, hey Jarvis, can you tell me what the local weather is right now? The current temperature is 76 degrees Fahrenheit, and the humidity is 94%. Talk to the medium size. Hey Nexus, can you tell me how many lights are turned on in the kitchen right now? There are two lights turned on in the kitchen right now. Hey Nexus, can you turn them off? The lights in the kitchen are now off. And you can actually see Nexus is right here. This is powering the entire home. There she is. Beautiful, right? And we'll talk to the one in the ceiling here. Hey Jarvis. Hey Jarvis. Can you turn on the living room TV? The TV in the living room is now on. Hey Nexus, can you turn off all the lights in the back patio? The lights in the back patio are now off. Hey Nexus. Can you check online for the current price of Bitcoin? The current price of Bitcoin is 106,287 US dollars and 51 cents as of the time the information was last updated. And so that was actually an online call that went out to the internet. You can choose to poke that hole in the system if you want to, and it will uh, reach out to the internet to get that kind of intelligence. All right, so I don't know about you guys, but I think this is really amazing. I mean, what you're witnessing is AI and LLMs breaking out of the browser window and affecting the physical world around you in really helpful ways without forcing you to trade away your privacy. Also, if you just take a moment and consider the portable cassette player that we had in the 80s, and then if you add a computer to it, you get the iPod, right? And if you take the telephone and the camera and you add a computer to it, you get the iPhone. And if you take the car and you add a computer to it, you get Tesla. So what do you think is going to happen when you add a computer to the home, especially an AI computer? I think you're going to get Nexus. And this vision can have massive implications on absolutely everything if you really sit down and think about it. All right, so how does Nexus work? Well, I'll be a little bit vague about what's going on underneath the hood because we're still refining some of the magic sauce and we haven't officially launched yet, but here's what I can tell you. We're building a custom carrier board for the eight gigabyte NVIDIA Jetson Orin Nano system on a chip. Yes, that's a lot of words. But you'll also be able to upgrade your Nexus to the Orin NX 16 gigabyte if you want to run more Docker containers and services. Now, I bet some of you are still asking, yeah, but why did you choose Jetson? Well, that's because it's affordable. 
much more affordable than a big gaming rig with a gigantic GPU or an enterprise server or even those somewhat performant LLM mini PCs. It's also a very modular platform, it's low power, and we can manufacture it at scale. Regardless, we will keep a close eye on all the new possible hardware platforms that come out in the future. It's just that today, Jetson wins for our use case. Nexus does run all the popular open source LLMs like Quinn and DeepSeek, etc., etc., but we've been really focused on optimizing for the Llama 3.2 LLM, specifically the 3 billion parameter model, with a custom Q4 quantization. In fact, we're already getting 22 to 25 tokens per second, all while running the entire text-to-speech and speech-to-text pipeline on the same hardware, and I think this is just the beginning. Also, Nexus does support all the major inference engines like Olama and VLLM, etc. And yes, we do have strong opinions on which ones are best, but I'm not going to get into that here just yet. Now, I'm also willing to bet some of you are saying, man, Brad, you were saying the wake word a lot in those demos, and that's kind of annoying. All I'll say is that you're not seeing the latest voice pipeline that we're already working on, so stay tuned. And the last thought here is LLMs are non-deterministic which is really a fancy way of saying that Nexus sometimes does make mistakes. They've done studies, you know, 60% of the time, it works every time. But we've spent a ton of time building really clever autocorrect and self-healing technologies that help keep the LLM as accurate as possible. In fact, we're already seeing a 100% success rate on Alan Porter's Assist Mini dataset. Alan, if you're watching this video, it's a brilliant testing platform. I'd love to meet you sometime. In the future, we're going to put out our benchmarking results for the larger, complex Assist dataset too. And I'll go ahead and tell you right now that we're already beginning to compete with the big tech, frontier, cloud-based LLMs. Okay, so hopefully that was enough info to get you all excited about what we're working on. If you want to support us, please go to futureproofhomes.net and purchase a Satellite One dev kit. Your purchase directly helps fund the development of Nexus and everything that we're working towards. You can also go to the website and get on the Nexus waitlist, futureproofhomes.net slash products slash Nexus. Also, join us on our Discord. We've got almost a thousand amazing members that are sharing ideas and building stuff and pushing forward with us. And if you know any talented folks like DSP and firmware engineers, AI and ML engineers, mechanical CAD designers, marketing minds, then please send all those people our way. Okay, that's it. I'm Brad Davis. This is Future Proof Homes. And always remember, your home, your voice, your AI. See you next time.